Some people don't want to say it. Some people need a push. Other people are just waiting to say, okay, you've got the numbers, let's go. There's no reason to be shy about it. In case you guys haven't noticed, we just occupied for almost a month. What does that tell you? What is the next thing we're going to do? Sit around and wait for the press to throw more garbage on us? Blanket this, 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 all that? Come on. They talk about that regularly. So why is it when they focus on us, we start thinking about it so much? Well, the better we look, the worse they look. Hey, it's not about the better we look. It doesn't matter what we look like. Because we all know what we look like. Uh, like when we went to the kitchen, we didn't know anything Yeah. Yeah. It's like, if anyone knew we were actually doing Yeah. Well, people do know, but their press will show it. So this is what I'm suggesting. Just like Sarah's taking the initiative to go stand up in front of somebody and say, pay attention to me. We've got tons and tons of great speakers. Take one of these guys from the kitchen community and put them in front of one of the city council's community meetings. And they can go in there as a speaker and say, I'm here on behalf of Occupy. This is what I've noticed through my experiences. This is what I have an issue. What are you doing about it to help us out? And by us, I don't mean us. I mean the Occupy who is not at Occupy. The ones who have to be at home to catch the early morning wake up for school and the supper after that. Or other different things. We've got a lot more support than what these numbers show. And as our numbers grow, we got to take the initiative. we got to take the initiative to make statements. I like to say we are the media. We are the media, guys. This is what it is. I propose to continue Sarah's campaign, Artists with the Cause. Let's take it across the entire city. I will personally volunteer myself and my own two legs and my hands. And I'll walk these streets in the cold and I'll knock on doors and I'll let people know about it. It's the simple as saying, hi, I'm here in support of your rates. Check out sarahbarbary.com. Here's the business card. Everybody else, we link into that, and our opinions count. They matter, so people can educate themselves on the real things. We all know what these cameras will do. People who are sitting in their houses who have never seen us will now see us and say, I identify with that. Well, now people who are in Ottawa will now be given a chance to identify with that. Because as they're watching us and they have been for the past few weeks, now we're going to show up and say, hi, I know you understand what I'm doing. Please stay tuned to the real source. It's a chance for us to start educating these people. Let's make this campaign go for as long as we can. People will give out art. And we'll put it together. We'll call it a masterpiece. We'll give it to the entire city council. And we'll say in 2011, we made a stand, we made a difference. They have to honor it, guys, because this is not violent, it is not peaceful, there's no malice behind it. We're simply saying, all we're asking for is a little bit of love. Is that too much to ask for in every single step, in every single essence? People here came out today to share a lot of beautiful things. We've got musicians, we've got artists, spiritual guides, future generations leaders. This is what this is all about, guys. You know, it's not like we gotta wait and see what happens, it's we gotta create. Some of us have been working different parts of this picture for a long time, and that's why we're sitting here. It's all starting to click and make sense. Building a team starts right here, right now. It's as simple as saying, hey, artists with the cops. I see what you're doing, I understand. Sarah and Jane and I have come up with a beautiful proposal. A beautiful proposal that we're going to give to the city and to the press and to the people and to everybody else who wants to watch all at once. All at once. In order for that to happen, we just have to let everybody know one shoe thing. This is about art, and it's about letting the art speak for itself. Nothing else behind it. It's not an individual issue, it's the fact that we all understand that, hey, people are giving to make a statement. So let's give. Let's give what we can. Because once we start giving, we see that we're still giving, despite the fact that we have to fight. For the little that we're given, they'll understand and things will change. It's been done before, now let's do it our way, the way that we know how combined and collect. Sarah needs a team of people.
people, out of everybody here, if you want to volunteer and help her out, I'm sure she would love it. And we can coordinate the next step, not something humongous, not something big. Let's just say, okay, two days we put together, one, two, three, four, five, six pieces of art. Most of that was seven, okay? However, out of the three people we talked to, three of them happened to be artists. All of them said they would donate, and one literally said, one second, here you go. It doesn't have to be an artist's work, it could be just a simple idea of giving and keeping the course. If you have a piece of art at your place, at your home, something you want to add to this movement, go ahead. And this is a way for us to connect everybody. Somebody was asking how to connect with pictures work, well everybody will look at this and say, yeah, I fit in. Everybody will look at it and say, yeah, I fit in, I know what this is about. And because of that, they're going to have to find out what the real reason is behind everybody else. And then we start educating people and we keep on changing the way people's minds work. Like, you know. that, like, it's not just art, it's your passion. Share your passion, what, like, whatever that is, jewelry making, poetry writing. Get that out and give it away and share that. The purpose of this painting is to kind of demonstrate how when you are expressing yourself exactly the way you want to express yourself without pressure, without being suppressed, just this is me, this is what I want to say. Being around that is inspiring. Connecting with that makes the vibrations of your own body and heart pump up. That kind of passion. This is someone's love. This is this is someone's whole heart that they want to get out and then share with someone essentially. So whatever that is, they just get it out. Share it. And it'll grow because someone else will be like, hey, that person shared a really awesome thing. Maybe I can do that to someone else too. It's about making connections, it's about knocking down divisions that separate us and really realizing that here, like in this in this world, on this planet, this is creation. And we can't create that. It's in our blood, it's in our bones, it's in our DNA. And to deny ourselves that ability, that capacity to continue and live that way. It's unnatural. So let's get it going. Get some other artists involved, get involved yourself in whatever way, whatever your passion is. Learn to express that and share it.